hey guys, I get asked a lot of questions about uh, you know, making picks at first base, the proper way to get a forehand pick, the proper way to do a backhand pick. I got a simple and easy drill that you guys can do at home. You can have your players do it uh, inside, in small areas. You can have them work on with, with tennis balls in, in their own bedroom. We don't need a glove for this drill. So we're gonna get rid of our glove, and all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a ball in my throwing hand. I'm gonna get my proper footwork on the base, heels on the bag. When I stride out to make a pick, the idea is that I stride to the throw, I get low, and I wanna bury my head behind my glove. All my weight is going from my back leg to my front leg, and I'm working through the ball. You'll see a lot of guys, they try to pick up, they pick across their body, but we wanna pick in the exact direction that the ball's traveling. So again, I'm starting heels on the bag, I'm reading the throw first, I'm striding to the throw, and now as I get down low, my head's behind my glove and I'm working through it, almost like I'm raking my fingers across the grass. So it's gonna look just like this. You're gonna take a ball in your bare hand, you're gonna toss it up, stride out, and pick back through. Reset, now we can go forehand. Ball in the bare hand, toss it up, stride back through, and I miss it. So if you miss it, you wanna miss it back that way. If you miss it, you don't wanna miss it across your body or up in the air. Let's try that again. We're gonna go backhand first, toss it up, backhand. Heels on the bag, toss it up, forehand. Your guys are gonna struggle with this at first. It's really tough to do with the bare hand. Once you get comfortable with the bare hand, it's gonna be that much easier when you get your glove on. Make a competition out of it. Have your guys line up, have your first baseman line up, walk out, see how far they can go without missing it. If they miss it, have them go back to the line and restart. A great way to make a competition out of it practice, have your four guys line up on the line and see how far out they can get without missing it. So they're gonna start with the backhand and then they're gonna replace their feet. And they're gonna Go next, forehand, then backhand, then forehand. And they work all the way out towards second base. As soon as they miss it, they have to go back to the, back to the line and restart.